Well, 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 herb sign people, welcome um, to this week of the 19th until the 25th, herb sign people. Wow, 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 what a week. It's major, major week, herb sign people. Oh, oh, oh. Wow, so the center of this week, Earth sign people, is about balance. It's about balance. A whole lot of balance is going to be coming up um, in this week. And I see that um, uh, women, women, uh, 50 years and older, you are like uh, bringing back balance um, in your relationship, in your marriage, in your family life, um, balance with your parents, um, standing your grounds if you notice the energy of uh, balance is here so a whole lot of you a uh, Virgos could be feeling this energy and uh, it's as if uh, Capricorns are going to be helping you Virgos in order to balance out some sort of a situation now uh, when we look at your week it's a like major major situation that is transpiring there is so much major arcana that is coming up in this week that is so um unaware the energy of the nine of cups together with some sort of a new contract some sort of a new start so information is going to be coming in um that a contract is going to be created okay so if a lot of you were waiting on some sort of a contract information is going to be coming out because this is if some sort of a um undesirable situation was transpiring and people were like kind of figuring out what was transpiring so the wheel of fortune is here as the center for a lot of you balance is going to be coming in and a lot of you whatever you have manifest is going to be coming in number two is playing a huge role Number two, energy is playing an absolutely, absolutely huge role um, in what is happening and transpiring um, in this week. And it's, this week is all about balance and it's going to be affecting a lot of you Virgos. And some of you Virgos that was dealing with a Sagittarian, you're going to be bringing back um, balance in your world because you recognize that the Sagittarian has created a a whole lot of issues a lot of you are basically working on yourself and working on things issues and situation that was transpiring if we see you come into this week with the four of cups and you're ending this week having no regrets okay a lot of you justice is going to be coming up and a tower moment is going to be coming down on some sort of unconventional play that someone was transpiring justice is here and you're going to be very very successful leaving this week because you're going to be leaving this week on a positive note success is going to be coming up at the end of the week and a lot of offers is going to be coming in and a lot of you are going to be standing your ground so so let's see the cross. The cross is about uh, a family member or a couple. Okay, it has to do with balancing out uh, a situation with your parents, balancing out situation with your husband, balancing out situation with your partners. And uh, this is significant because a lot of you women, fifty years and older, are going to be successfully coming and finding out the truth of a corporation institution of what a corporation institution have done. A lot of you are going to be having some sort of issues with your parents, so expect, expect that to come up if your parents are still alive. Communication is going to be key um, between you and your partner in this week, and I see some sort of a cycle is going to be over, and you're going to be successfully overcoming what was transpiring. Truths are going to be revealed, and I see... Um, a lot of you women are going to be standing your ground and justice is coming up against uh, a group of people that was creating a whole lot of issues in your world. A lot of you are going to be receiving something and I see you're going to be standing your ground and communicating about some sort of an undesirable play that has transpired um, in a corporation institution and um your boss, your, a lot of you are going to be standing up against your boss or someone who used their powers in a wrong way. Then I see a lot of you are going to be ending a cycle, the energy of the sun. A lot of your offer is going to be coming in at the end of this week. A lot of you are going to be making a decision because you are ending um, some sort of a play that was going on. If you notice the energy of the two of pentacles, you're breaking down something and ending some sort of a play. 
the energy of the nine of cups is upright and uh, i see a lot of you are going to be successfully overcoming um whatever that was transpiring in your world and it's as if you already manifest and whatever you have manifest is going to be coming in there is no question about this A lot of you, as you come into this week, you're going to be receiving something. Whether or not you take it, I see you're going to be completely communicating what it is that you want. A lot of you, too, is going to be coming out and the Wheel of Fortune is going to be bringing you back something um, from your mother or some of you ladies um, are going to be receiving something that was taken and you're going to be bringing it back balance in your life and you're going to be successful because the energy of the magician is going to be lightening your way and showing you in which direction to go. Justice is coming down on a group of people that was using their um, their ego in a certain way. Um, I see um, their bosses are now recognizing some sort of a secret, secret that was going on and a huge trouble moment is coming down. And because of this huge double moment, a lot of you are going to be making your making a decision in order to clear some sort of a problem that was going on and making sure that people recognize uh, that this is no game. Um, you're, you, you're resolving things and showing people that I am not playing. I don't play. I am I'm bringing back balance in my world and the people who I love and support in my world. And I'm going to be bringing back balance in the correct way. So emotionally, a lot of you will receive something. But whether or not you will take what you are offered, that is another question. So I see um, the energy of uh, things are going to be showing up. Um, some sort of information is going to be coming out. And you women are going to be standing your ground and bringing down. It, you're going to be like... I'm bringing down justice on whatever that was transpiring because you recognize, hey, you have gone too far now and I'm not playing this game. This is a serious situation now. So that is going to be good because a lot of you are going to be really standing up. If you recognize the pyramid in um, the, the crowning of this week is that if you notice, justice is beside your enemies, so the ego, um, the negative forces, justice is here. And I see that people's, um, people in authority is now looking at what was happening and transpiring. And people in authority is now recognizing a situation and how people were using their egos to create some sort of a problem for a lot of you women and your partners. And I see that they are going to be ending this because the energy of the sun is upright and the energy is like of the sun is shedding light, um, shedding light on a process that was going on. And because light is being shed on the situation now, a whole lot of people and um, a negative situation around you is going to be falling away because you're standing up and you're taking back your powers and standing up and saying, hey, um, you know, you have walked over me and you have done me certain things, but guess what? It's not going to be happening anymore because I'm taking back my reign and I'm taking back my life. So however this was transpiring and affecting you guys in your worlds, you're going to be recognizing where you are at this moment and is going to be sending and protecting yourself and bring some sort of a rehabilitation um, around your life and around issues and problems that was transpiring. And it's, it's, this week is like taking back your power. So this is what we're going to be calling this week. This week is a week where you earth sign people are going to be taking back your powers and letting people know, hey, you know, a lot of people have used you, use your um, good heart, use you and now you are a uh, you're, you have recognized this for yourself and it's going to be bringing back and taking back your um your empowerment you're going to be empowering yourself you're not letting people rain in on your parade anymore because you're going to be bringing back something to let people understand hey 
you have gone a little bit too far with earth sign earth sign is not if you notice earth sign there is less people that you're dealing with you're basically just clearing away situation issues that people had created for a lot of you oh very very powerful and the center is that is that there was some sort of a secret maybe a family member a child your husband or wife was keeping some sort of a secrets or some sort of secrets about your parents and you're letting people know that this is no secrets but if i don't need to share my information i don't need to share it with you and this is good because it is as if too much people have rain on your parade um earth sign people it's it's it's, it's, it's as if people were coming and you know, raining. Ooh. So let me just walk over earth sign people. And you're like, hell no. I mean, you know, back up people. I might be busy and looking the other way. But I have two eyes in my back that I'm recognizing what is coming at me. You know, and you earth sign people are going to be letting people know, hey, two hair and no further. Because you have gone over my boundaries. And I'm taking back my power. So secrets, and I see information is coming out where um, you ladies are standing your grounds. Um, whatever has transpired, you ladies are standing your grounds and showing up a play that was transpiring and said, listen, it is ending now. Because if you notice how you're ending it, it's like uh, a new contract is going to be coming in. Uh, and the energy of the nine of cups is that your wishes and dreams uh, and Saturn is coming in right behind it to hit and said, listen, Saturn is here and Uranus is going to be coming up right after Saturn. So it's as if a lot of you earth sign people are being affected by the planetary aspect. And it's as if um the Orcanus are coming up and said, hurt sign people, this is your week. Uh, run with it because Taurus uh, has just begun um their season so guess what taurus virgo capricorn let's get going for 2021 now you're going to be having the support because capricorn gave you a little support in january february but now um the taurus season of the second house is coming in and you earth sign is like i gotta get my um my second house my money flow going and you know, I don't have any time for drama and I don't have any time for drama people. And I don't need to have drama and drama people in my life because you just drain my energy. I'm about to move forward. Hate me or not. I am a hurt sign person and I rule the energy of the pentacles. So, you know, you, you hurt sign people. This is just so powerful. This is one of the most powerful readings I've ever read with so much major arcana and if you notice every week you have a major arcana one or two okay the last week is the, the energy of the star and you're going to be receiving some sort of an offer and because you stood your ground to something that went a little bit too far and you said hey listen your game and whatever the game that you people were playing is now going to be over because I'm ending it. I'm a hurt energy. I rule the pentacles. I rule um, with uh, Saturn, Venus, and uh, with uh, Neptune, okay? Um, Mercury. Mercury is the energy of the Gemini, the, the Virgos, and the Virgos is going to be running this week and helping a lot of you earth sign people to make sure that communication is clear with your partner secrets are coming out communication is clear with your boss you're using the sword of truth if you notice how the sword of truth stands firm is that virgo is saying to you earth sign people use the sword of truth you don't have to fight with anyone use the sword of truth the sword of truth will make things show up okay use the sword of truth you have the inner wisdom and guidance and information and there is a um you know as you get to the end of the week uh, um the the magician is coming up and say hey really don't have to help you earth sign because you have done very well 
So heart sign, this week is the beginning of the Taurus season. Go and check out your Taurus season and make sure that it is a week on time out so you guys can know what is coming up in your Taurus season. You have to choose a crystal in the Taurus season in order to recognize how to balance out the problems in the Taurus season. So, you know, go for it because Taurus, uh, your sister sign, the Tauruses and you Tauruses is going to be absolutely fantastic. Go check out your Taurus reading for the Tauruses that was born 20th of April until 25th of April. Go check out your reading. But Earth sign people, you're going to be making... Um, and showing up for yourself and making things that people realize that, hey, it's not happening on my watch. Okay? So, in the first week, Monday, some sort of information and offer is going to be coming in. People are going to be recognizing what was happening. The Wheel of Fortune is coming back. And I see a lot of you business people could be offered some sort of an offer. And the excuses will be followed by that because people in power have recognized um, some sort of a foul play that was transpiring. Okay. Some of you and um, your boss, you could be offered a management position. Take it, run with it. Um, however, this is coming up. Take it and run with it. A lot of you are going to be finding out that an Aries uh, justice is not in favor of the Aries. You earth sign are going to be winning and winning big. On a Tuesday, um, information, the worries um, that a lot of you women have, a lot of you were worried, constantly worried, it is going to be over. Uh, someone's secrets has come out, and Aries, the Earth, Sagittarian secret has come out. Um, the Wheel of Fortune is bringing back information and letting a lot of you women be aware that your boss or a supervisor or an Aries man was your biggest problem and the wheel of fortune is going to be released in this first because justice is not in their favor but it's in your favor on wednesday you're using the sword of truth you're using the sword of truth and letting people recognize what has been transpiring you virgos are going to be tearing down something whoever that was trying to um, use their powers against you virgos you're going to be taking it down because you Virgos are going to be recognizing, hey, a witchcraft, black magic, I'm not afraid of. This is going to be handed. And this is going to be good. Um, then I see um, you ladies are going to be standing up against your boss or standing up with people in power. And it's going to be making something very clear. Whoever these people are, they got to be recognizing that you're coming and you're coming hard at them. Because you recognize that... Um, you know, they need to, um, they're being paid in order, um, to, to resolve a situation. And you're saying, you know, I am the one that have to be resolving the situation. You need to look here. You need to look there. And you're going to be recognizing, Hey, um, I am going to be making a lot of changes. And, you know, people in authority, you need to look at, uh, um, closer to what is going on and make these changes. So that a lot of people can have less full, less stressful situation. On Friday, on um, uh, Thursday, I see some sort of a contract that was, uh, um, you know, you were supposed to get some contract and they were dragging their foot, dragging their foot. You're going to say, listen, this month is not going to be ending before I get this contract. This contract needs to be created. Okay. And I see you are going to be standing your ground. I see um, a Virgo is going to be coming in and helping a lot of you Tauruses and Capricorn people and really re revealing secrets and helping you guys to resolve some sort of a situation. Virgos expect some sort of a um, promotion, management promotion coming at you Virgos. You Virgos are going to be using the sword of truth to take down some sort of a secret step and relieve, reveal some sort of a secret that was happening. On Friday, your wishes and dreams is going to be coming true. The energy of the sun is here revealing something that was going on that a lot of you were not aware of. 
I see um, a lot of you Virgos are going to be standing up and showing management um, some sort of a play that was transpiring and showing up a scorpion for something that a scorpion has do as Donna and really standing your ground because this is like um people that was creating a whole lot of issues around you guys emotion you have no more emotion it's as if a lot of you your emotion has run dry there's no time for crying there's no time for you know thinking twice about uh, um you know I, I like that person or don't like no it, it's about listen um this week is a week that i have the energy and the powers within me and their deities that is going to be helping me to resolve the unconventional issues and problems that has been transpiring in my world and ending it the weekend a cycle is going to be over and a lot of you are going to be successful and um, the magician is uh it's as if the magician is saying, yes, earth sign people, you have done it. You have really done this, earth sign people. Go ahead. Walk through that gate. Take um, what belongs to you, okay? Then I see some sort of a balance that was supposed to be making. A whole lot of you have balanced out your emotional situation. And this is what I'm saying to a lot of you, earth sign people. There was no emotions. You have absolutely no emotions. Whatever that was happening and transpiring, your emotion is dried up. You have no time to cry and you have no time um, to think twice. You are cutting through um, whatever that was transpiring. So this is a lovely, lovely um, week for you guys. And, you know, thank God to your sister sign, the Tauruses. Uh, the Tauruses is opening up uh, um, this energy for a lot of you. So take this energy and run with it because this is the beginning of the Taurus season. The Taurus season is your sister sign. Your sister sign is bringing in the major um, arcanas in order to resolve some sort of a problems and issue that was being created. And this is going to be good. Okay, so um, this is extremely, extremely powerful. Um, there is no question about this. So, so as we record, uh, as we see on Monday, you could be having some sort of a problem seeing the truth of a scorpion. And uh, uh, on Tuesday, your worries is going to be over. And um, um, some sort of a problem that was affecting your world, um, the energy of the devil is going to be, um, and is going to be there. Um, on Wednesday, you're using the sword of truth. Um, to resolve some sort of a situation. And on Thursday, I see like people are going to be wanting to um, reveal to you something that you were not aware of. Okay, so it could be your parents that is uh, um, telling some of you something that you were not aware of. Friday is going to be a very good day because um, whatever secrets that your enemy or your boss or your supervisor had, it's going to be over because they're going to be recognizing um, this a cycle is now over the magician is as if earth sign you have done well um, you have manifest what you want it is here run with it and the energy of the star being offered something you're going to be taking that offer and is going to be running with it and using that whatever you're offered to make the right decision um, moving forward and this is going to be good so as we recognize um the Wheel of Fortune is bringing back something in your world um, that was either taken from you and you're standing your balance together um, with having um, power and energy back and opening up new doors of opportunities for yourself. Doors um, that people had closed, doors that people didn't want you to walk through. You are going to be reopening up back those doors and it's going to be taking back your powers and re-empowering yourself and letting people know, um, you know, life, we are all here on a journey and we are all here to get what it is that we were open for. I'm taking back what I was supposed to get, okay? So it's as if someone wanted to, like, take you down, take um, your um, financial stability, take your life, take it, and you're like, no. No, I'm not playing this. I'm sorry. Um, figure it out somewhere else, but it's not going on. 
on my earth sign boundary once I'm an earth sign. So enjoy. This is going to be powerful. It's about you balancing out um, things around you. Um, a lot of you who were looking for some sort of a new contract, it is going to be coming in. Some of you is, is as if you wanted a new contract and they're going to be saying, no, no, no. You get what it is. You don't need to make any changes. You know, as we look at what has transpired, no, 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 no changes is going to be made. Um, you know, things are going to be going on the same. And um, this is going to be good for a lot of you. I gotta go. Namaste until next time.